so today we're just gonna be sculpting that uh, little dog that I have on the corner just right right there <laughs> it's gonna be a fat body and then it's gonna have a clay face and I hope everything will be fine I'll just leave it there for now <laughs> Oh, I can't feel. <laughs> cannot feel my fingers anymore. Uh, there's so much mixing. It's not even fully mixed yet. Maybe one day, if I do more of this, I'll invest in a pasta machine to help mix clay, but I don't see it very useful in the minute. Okay. I think that's pretty much good. Okay, <laughs> my clay is mixed. Is that super hot? That's fine. <sighs> Tea with honey. <laughs> okay, so. little base so I don't have to touch it that's a little bit <laughs> it's a bit dusty I haven't used it in a while see no it's not dust actually it's um, it's a primer or something it smells like it smells like primer or whatever spray of some kind Big for her. It's 
bit big. That's more like it. Right. Okay, so we have like a size. Oop. Which is. It's fine. It's a good size. Okay. Can you guys see what I'm doing? That's the tool. Right. Yeah, that's cool. Can't see my face. <laughs> so I have to work on the side. <laughs> Can I have hiding my face? That's fine. Right, we have a lump. <laughs> That's a good looking lump. Thank you. 
Right. I haven't actually sculpted any dogs before, so this is kind of a new thing for me. So like, well, <laughs> eyes would be here. Hehehe. <laughs> 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 So like <laughs> Coucou Megan, je suis un peu malade. <rire> Désolé. Ça 
C'est bien ma, fa ma veine. Je tombe malade, genre euh, une, une fois par an, même pas. <rire> Mais bon, ça devrait se calmer, je pense. <rire> c'est pas grand chose, c'est juste un mal de gorge, mais comme je suis jamais malade, c'est un peu euh, euh, la panique. <rire> pas la malade, mais au bon, moins tu es toute jolie. Ah Merci. <rire> Ça va. Ah. Je vais retirer la webcam plus que c'est ça. Je vais, Je vais retirer la webcam puisque c'est ça. <rire> non, c'est juste un mal de gorge, mais... Euh... Comme ça n'arrive pas souvent. Oula, qu'est-ce que c'est que cette musique Disasterpiece, que fais-tu It follows, bah ben. Non. <rire> voilà, c'est mieux. J'aime bien réussir à entretenir des cheveux teints aussi bien. Bim En fait, le vert, ça tient vachement bien. <rire> C'est con à dire, mais c'est, enfin, la, la couleur est, est très euh, tenace. J'ai laissé tomber, j'arrivais pas à garder un joli violet. Ouais, c'est euh, tout ce qui est euh, rouge, orange, tout ça. Enfin, violet encore ça va parce qu'il y a du bleu, mais euh, à un moment donné j'avais du rose derrière et euh, c'est parti en genre euh, de lavage. J'étais triste. <rire> Aussi, euh, petit secret pour euh, garder les cheveux teints longtemps, il faut pas se les laver trop souvent. <rire> Et à l'eau froide, aussi. Enfin, je me lave les cheveux peut-être une... Allez, une, une à deux fois par semaine. C'est suffisant. Et... Euh... Mmh. Ouais, à l'eau froide, enfin euh, aussi froid que possible en fait. Euh... Alors, okay. Ah, souvent prenez l'inverse, le bleu par direct, je suis coincée avec des cheveux rouges. Ah <rire> C'est peut-être une, une marque différente, alors, je sais pas. Ça doit peut-être marcher différemment, euh, dépendant des... des teintures et tout. Mais euh, pas cool, en tout cas. Je suis pas une très grande fan de, de, de rouge, euh, rose, euh, tout ça. Enfin, rose ça va encore, mais les cheveux rouges, je sais pas. J'ai une tante qui a les cheveux rouges, elle a la cinquantaine. Un rouge à 50, ça va pas. <rire> non, ça va pas. C'est très... Euh, Je sais pas. Enfin bon, pourquoi pas, hein, mais... Enfin bon, après, je me dis que... Euh... Même quand je serai vieille, je me vois toujours avec les cheveux, les cheveux colorés. Je ne sais pas trop ce que j'ai fait. Là. Hmm, mystère, mystère. Alors, on a quand même un peu plus qui devait avoir 50. Orange vif avec... Non, c'est pas cool. 
Bonjour, euh, madame. <rire> C'est pas cool, en effet. C'était peut-être une erreur, hein, une erreur du coiffeur. Donc oui, voilà, c'est euh, mon petit... Euh, ah, super, ça tient pas à la caméra. Attends, je remonte un peu. Yop. Euh, voilà, j'ai terminé ça. Aujourd'hui. Et donc, c'est la base pour... Euh, hop. Ce petit visage que je dois finir. Non, non, je l'ai vu comme ça au fil des années. Ah oui, quand même. <rire> Et donc, elle a gardé, elle s'est dit, oh, ça passe Euh, T'as fait le corps comment Alors, c'est euh, de la laine feutrée. Merde. Ah, t'en as déjà fait toi la laine feutrée Je sais plus. Je sais plus si c'était avec toi que j'en parlais. Enfin, je te montre très quand même. Donc, il euh, y a de, on a de la laine comme ça euh, euh, en écheveau. Et puis, ben, euh, ensuite, euh, t'as des aiguilles. Donc, euh, c'est des aiguilles spéciales. Je sais pas si. La caméra arrivera à le montrer, mais là. Je sais pas, on voit un tout petit peu, il y a des. Euh, des petits. Euh, des petites encoches sur euh, les, les. aiguilles. Et donc, euh, voilà, tu, tu poques. Tu poques à l'infini, tu poques tes doigts aussi. Et <rire> ça finit par marcher. Euh. Ouah. C'est parce que j'ai pas encore fait euh, les... C'est que du blanc, hein. pour l'instant j'ai pas encore fait les taches de couleur et tout. Parce que on, je fais le petit, le petit chien qui est là, dans le coin. Et euh, donc bah, j'ai encore du boulot sur le corps. Ouh, pardon. J'ai encore du boulot sur le corps, mais euh, ça passe. <rire> ça passe, ça passe, ça avance. Avec mes outils faits maison dont je ne me servirai probablement pas parce que j'utilise tout le temps le même. <rire> ok. Merci. But still, I think I'm gonna switch to English if you don't mind, just in case there's non-English people, non-French people, sorry, around. I'm not gonna be talking super loud anyway, so if you can't hear me, just tell me because I think my microphone is picking it up, but uh, it's just in case. Okay, this is not working, I'm gonna have to take this off. My monster clay. <laughs> the, that base I did for. Um, I think I've put it together for another project. It still had the clay on it, so... There. Mm. 
this so just put this aside somewhere I don't know there punk is it like that See if I can put that in the shot somewhere. Doo -doo. So I've literally never sculpted any dogs before, so it's gonna be... Try and error, I'm gonna try. <laughs> You can do it. <laughs> How many little fish in Yeah, um, it's uh, you have to estimate. Um, it's uh, it, it depends the firmness of what you want to do. Like the more the tighter you felt it, the more firm it is. Um, so it depends. Like I'd rather. Like most of the time I just use less than I need and then I build on top of it. Um, it's very expensive. I don't I don't think it's I don't think it's really expensive, but um, like compared to other uh, crafts depends where you go. But then again I haven't bought I haven't really bought um, felt in ages. Like, I literally have a collection of like maybe between 15 and 55 bags of colors. <laughs> no, 15, sorry, 15 to 20 bags, I'd say. <laughs> so I didn't, I haven't had the need to buy any for a while. Okay, doggies. I have a doggy at home, I have three dogs, I should know. More or less. Oops. Stick. Uh, probably have the equivalent of three bucks like that, but a mix of colors. Yeah, so that's like your starter kit now. You buy needles and, and a mix of colors, yeah. What you could do is, um, if you have a certain project in mind, you could buy what you need for that project, but like maybe one big bag, um, of like, I don't know if you need brown and purple, get like one big bag of each. Or what you can do if you're afraid of running on one color, you can um, buy a generic cheap one for uh, doing like a base, like a core. So like for example, for this, you could do like a big ball of that core color and then build the rest with the colored wool, so you don't use as much. Okay. Maybe I should put something in the back. Sorry, I have my toolbox, but it's just under the mic, so it's maybe noisy um where's my i have my pliers i don't know where my uh, are they but my wire is very good point haha <laughs> Just 
try something. A uh, few people use styrofoam balls. Um, tin foil as a base. Why not? Just I think depends what you're gonna do with it. I don't know if. Um, Hmm, good question. I've never thought about that. Um, I don't know if tinfoil um, rusts. I don't know if it gets rusty with time, I'm not sure. I would say no. The only thing also you probably will uh, damage your needles if you use tin foil. Oh my god. It's unsticking. It's bothering me. What do I do? fix this problem. What I had before was good. Or maybe it will stick better on a piece of foil, I'm not sure. I'm tired, let's see. I don't have foil here, I don't think so. Because it's... The whole purpose of this is to like, so I can have it on the base, but... I'm gonna see if I have anything that I can stick on in my beautiful uh, my drawers down on the side. Oh well, I have washi tape. <laughs> I can try something like this. It's really fancy washi tape for what I'm gonna do, but or maybe no, maybe because this one doesn't stick quite well. I'm, I've just got some. I've got cheap masking tape. and stick <laughs> there oh god right that doesn't even stick to that <laughs> no even that doesn't stick to that wood, it's too polished. Or whatever, I'll just put a coat of... That thing I had before. Trial and error, trial and error. Okay. Ta da! <laughs>
that's not even sticking on there. <laughs> Oh my god, that looks horrible. <laughs> well, it's a start, I guess. It's not that bad, but maybe one more of a cranium unless he's meant to be simplified. Yeah, um, because it's gonna be only like, you know, there's already gonna be that bit of the head. I'm just doing basically the face. So, you know what I mean? The guy sit very far forward. Yeah, I know what you mean. Let's see. <laughs> Just I've got the picture of the doggy from the... I've got a front-facing picture and a picture from the side. Profile, whatever. <laughs> but I think you're right. Yeah, I see. Right, I'm not gonna trim any forward because any further, sorry, because the that's the size that I'm going to go for, but yeah, I will because I see what you mean, I see it on there, so mm-hmm. Okay. Mm 
Evet. The gears are turning. <laughs> How do I do this? <laughs> Right, so right now it looks more like a bear than anything else, but... <laughs> no. <laughs> yes, perfect. <laughs> That's it. Done. <laughs> Ta da! You know, like the worst thing is I have two pictures in front of me, but I've never, never tried sculpting dogs before, so I'm like, what? This is harder than I thought it would be. Oops, lion <laughs> shot. She needs eyebrows, I think. See if that does something for us. <laughs> ah. 
I am angry. Yeah. Doesn't look like her at all. Ah, is that it? Was that the end of the playlist? I think it was. Uh, what do I put next? I like disaster peas. I can do Ezekiel. Ezekiel, bye. Yeah. I'm not in shot most of the time, I think I should put this like that, so... Yeah. Right, so she has like... That's a really heavy face. She's got a long nose, like a really long nozzle. And a small head, so... I think her nose is gonna have to be much longer. Just shorten the sides again. Now I'm gonna have monster clay mixed with the sculpey when I'm gonna bake, but it's okay. We'll see if that's a problem or not. Oh, hi, Dongles! Thanks for hosting! Hope you're okay. It's looking pretty <laughs> horrible at the moment, but hopefully things go better. I've never sculpted any dogs before and this is a bit of a disaster. <laughs> mm. How are you anyway? Did you have a good new year?
This is punk. This is very creepy. <laughs> uh, once the draw for the gingerbread doggy, it's uh, on the fifth. Uh, I should probably do a reminder. Ah, it's bug net, not bug hunt. <laughs> Doing well, this face is for the fitted body. Yes. Ta da! So I finished it. I, yeah, I, I know I posted the legs and everything, but I finished the arms today. So, ta -da, ta -da. there. Yay! A thousand beetle points! Well done! <laughs> I'm shouting in my throat, is like, no, don't do that. Got <laughs> uh, a lot of people are participating. Nah, not really. It's not working really well. I don't know why, I thought they would be more, you know, that it would interest more people. Um, but I've got maybe five, <laughs> four or five people participating in the giveaway, so it's it's okay, you know. More, more chances for you to win. <laughs> Very cool, thank you! The face is not going really well for now, but I'm sure with time. <laughs> Once I figure out how dogs work. I've got pictures on the side, but it's not helping much. I should really try um, practicing more sculpting. Like anatomy and stuff like that, but... Hmm... Put them on the sides... Because I'm doing this commission, it's that that dog in the corner. Um, it's basically for um, one of my colleagues' mom. Because she got me some she got me some stuff at Christmas. <laughs> like like how I've I think I've seen her maybe a dozen of times in my entire life, and she's so she's such a nice person. Uh, and she got me like three presents. I was like, what the hell? So I thought I would make her a portrait of her doggy that passed last year. That was like very blind, but very cute. <laughs> very old also. I think she passed. She was 16 years old. <laughs> Her name was Rosie. Let's see. Uh, 
Aha. That's awesome, isn't it? That's that's just so nice. <laughs> but she's like that apparently. She loves everyone. She she's giving away everything to everybody else and not thinking about her too much. <laughs> Why am I struggling so much? See if it works if I do something else. Mm -hmm. This is getting somewhere. I feel Uh, so let's see Is this really cat? This is probably way more realistic than I should have put. <laughs> Gonna prologue for a bit, making dinner. Yeah, what are you doing? I already ate. I already ate today. I had some rice with salmon. It was fancy. <laughs> Enjoy your lurking. Sorry if I'm not talking too much, so I throat at all. Tea. <laughs> I 
She looks good on one side and crazy on the other side. Like, mm. <laughs> I think I kind of figured it out for the head shape. Uh, but I'm gonna redo those eyes because they just look creepy, <laughs> I think. Hmm. Profiles look okay there, but front two looks weird. Doggo. <laughs> it's getting there, yay! Yeah, it's not as bad as it was uh, half an hour ago. It's just the eyes that just look creepy. I know I shouldn't do any details now, but just to oh yeah, eat the dog. <laughs> That's a bit askew. That's like probably way too realistic for that body. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> I'll just redo the whole thing. The whole eye area.
Right. What if I just do this? <laughs> uh, I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> it just looks weird. Okay, I'm gonna try and... I think we still need like some kind of brow. So... Oh my god, this is even worse. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> I'll find a way eventually. Look, if you want to make it <laughs> even creepier. <laughs> da -da 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 yeah. <laughs> Ah, I know what I what I should do. Sorry. Thank you. Okay, here I have a new. Ooh. What was that? My controller. Here I have a live model that I can use. It doesn't show very well on camera, <laughs> but I, I can use him. Louis, look at me. <laughs> Look at me. Look at me. Look. Okay. Let's see your face. So, little eyes. Yes. Yes. Look at this. Now look at your face. Eh. Eh. Well, I'm pretty much there. It's just like... Mm-hmm. I see. I see. It was just an excuse to pet my dog. Really? Isn't it cute? Look, you can help me out. Help me out. Help me out. <laughs> Come on. Oh, good boy. Okay. So I should... <laughs> oh, it's flatter on the sides. Hmm. 
I think I'm gonna try what I did before. So, there. <laughs> Creepy <laughs> stuff of nightmares. Oh boy. <laughs> it's really nice I have a live model whenever I want it. So Well, I don't know. Kind of looks more like a piggy now. Nah, what I just did was wrong. She has more. Um, I can see on her picture she has more here. It's not as sharp. So. See, I think I have a front face. Okay. So I can see she has more on the sides. Yeah. Very good.
Let's see. She has a bigger nose than what I did. If I compare the spacing of the eyes, her nose is bigger. I think. Just a tiny bit bigger, yeah. So I'll just try and flatten it and it should do it. Right, something I've done wrong is the mouth. Should be much higher. Oops, <laughs> sorry. Now she just looks like she has an overbite. Mm -hmm. Like that dog on Instagram, Tuna. She's called Tuna, I think. That dog's got a drastic uh, overbite and she literally looks like um, a bee. <laughs> Can't even do this. Is that the weird Shiba Inu? No, she's like um Oh, uh, I don't remember. See, I'll see if I can find her. Um, it's not a Shiba Inu, it's more like um, um Lévrier. <laughs> I don't know how it's called. Um, No, it's a, um, a Chiwini. Um, the Instagram is literally, it's Tuna the dog underscore. And she looks like this, <laughs> poor thing. <laughs> I love her, she's so cute. No, it's true now.
so you can really say I've got a dog like nobody else has. She's very unique. <laughs> She's special. <laughs> Very special. So who are you thinking about? The weird Shiba? It's better than it was, so... It's just the eyes I want to fix, but I don't know what to do. Ah, let's see. <laughs> no, that's super cute! <laughs> like this. <laughs> Oh no, I love him! How cute is that? <laughs> okay, I guess we'll just do like... Um Yes, Louis, what do you want? What do you want? Oh yeah. What do you want? Oh. 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 <laughs> My dog is also very special. He's got a uh, He's got an underbite, but you can't really see it anymore because like he he lost some of his teeth at the front, so he's only got his two canines. They're like like this coming out of his mouth. Eh? <laughs> but he's really black, so he doesn't show well on camera. Good doggy. What you want? Leave me alone. <laughs> well, the nose looks better than it was. He's having a party on the floor. What? <laughs> Tiny bit more now.
to my eyebrows. Mm -hmm. Oh, Louis, you're sad. You want to go back? Good boy. You have suffered enough. You can go away. Okay. <laughs> Usually he wants to stay with me all the time, but he must have been born. Like, you're not taking care of me. I'm gonna go where. <laughs> where people can actually pay attention to me. more like it. Don't know. Quite happy about the mouth part. Uh, just trying to see what else I can improve. That, that side looks okay, but for some reason it doesn't really show well on the other side. <laughs> oh! You got a camouflaged beetle, well done. I don't want to use Blender anymore, why? Something wrong with Blender? Blender's not your friend anymore. How is the frog going? <laughs> That famous project. <laughs> I can't do things nearly as fast as I do in Max and I get stuck. Well, use Max, can't you, for personal projects?
think just uh, not for commercial. Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, <laughs> it took me long enough. Not for commercial. What? Yeah, you don't have a license for 3ds Max. Yeah, I need these pretzels. <laughs> I don't have why well, I I understand. <laughs> don't have that. I didn't know it was a yearly subscription. I thought it was just like a license, like a lifetime license. But they don't do that anymore, do they? Even Photoshop's a yearly subscription now. Well, yearly, monthly, whatever. A lifetime license used to be four thousand dollars. Well, well, it's a bit better, I guess, but yeah. That's what it's gonna be the standard from now on, no? Uh, that anyone does the software is still available. Ah, I see. So you didn't have to pay anything. <laughs> so you got used to that software and now you have to use the the crappy free alternative. Well, crappy. And still, I'm not really a um, blender um, professional but you can still do good things with it oh but think about it if you get used to the the crappy one then when you when you get to uh, actually work on a better one, you'd feel like you'll feel like it's so much easier. Mm -hmm. 
There we go. Just checking something. Because I want to catch someone's stream afterwards. So I'm just making sure I don't stream too long. <laughs> Been two hours. Not bad. Not bad. Now it's actually looking cute and not too creepy. like it's it's mixing with monster clay and that's not good so I should probably take it out the base and make sure there's no monster clay involved because monster clay is not meant to be baked and so Oh, it's fine. It didn't actually stick too much to the clay, so we're good. Oops. Just banging this. <laughs> I give up start max. <laughs> I won't, I won't. <laughs> Are you sure what you're doing? Is it something you can show or? Control. Ah, well. <laughs> it's all fine. I had my I had my doubts, but I was asking just in case. Right. 
um, making a building and all I want to do. Ah, okay. Oh, it's fine. So it's just like, it's not if it was like modeling or anything like that. But it's not gonna conflict with Blender, the Blender files and everything. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna export back to a generic file type. Ah, right. Makes sense. Mm. Okay, so question I'm asking myself is... Yeah, I think it's gonna look weird. I was thinking... What if I... Pick this face up and then what if I sculpt um, the ears like this so it's like one full piece but I think it's gonna look a little bit weird um, so I'm gonna sculpt the, the ears separate and I'm gonna pop them on top there I think that's a better choice. And that way I can position them the way I want instead of being stuck with this. Okay. Not too bad, not too bad. Oh, the nose, wait. I'm pretty sure that this is not what dog noses look like. So I'm gonna Google it real quick. <laughs> eh, pretty close. Ah, uh, yes, that's why I thought. I knew that there was some... Um, Okay. So I knew that there was something going on on the sides. So. There. Dun, 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 dun. Oops. I need a smaller tool, let's see. Mm. I've got one somewhere that's like a needle. There. Oh, it's <laughs> I haven't pulled it out in a while and look. Let's see if I can get it to focus. Come on. Yeah, look, it's a bit. <laughs> Like, what the heck is this? <laughs> it's not straight anymore. <laughs> Let's see if I can straighten it. 
Oh my god. I can still work with it, I mean, but... <laughs> Wow, I'll have to work with that. <laughs> it's a needle. <laughs> oh god, it's more like a like a weird snaky, weird snaky thing. It's fine. I'll work with that. Mm -hmm. I'm making a mess more than anything. It looked better before. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Right, to do. -do, -do. It's looking like something. Okay. Ooh. I don't know if I should start the uh, the ears now or not. Um, I think maybe what I should do is wait until that's um, until that's baked, so I can um, put the face in place on this, and then like sculpt kind of like <laughs> I don't know if I make any sense. Sculpt the, the ears on there so that I have the good proportions and I know where they are going and everything because. If I sculpt them now, I think I'll make mistakes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. So yeah, this is gonna go on there. Um, moving arms and legs. This is maybe a 
bit too realistic for the um, the rest, but I mean, I'm trying stuff. We'll see if that works. I can always, well, anyway, I've still ha I still have quite a lot to do on this body. Um, obviously, she's got like spots and things like that. The fur is not all white. She's got tail and all that stuff. Okay. Um, actually, I'm thinking I might um, end the stream now. Because I've pretty much done um, the interesting part. Afterwards, maybe I'll just smooth it down a bit. And then I'll bake it, sand it, and you know. So. I've done the interesting bit. <laughs> I can spend three hours on stream smoothing everything down, but I don't think that's interesting to anybody. <laughs> Looks like a pretty productive evening. Yes! I'm happy. And, um, well, today I also did the whole arms, and that took about two hours. So, all in all, good stuff. And I'm happy because I didn't, I, honestly, I haven't sculpted in a while. Last time was maybe three months, four months ago. So that was nice. So that just goes to show that even if it looks crappy <laughs> to start with, you just keep going. <laughs> it will, you'll get there somewhere, somehow, with, <laughs> with time. Because we went through... A good few stages of ranging ranging from crappy to creepy and that's not perfect but it's it's a start and once I bake it then I can sand it and then I can add more stuff and bake it again if anything without having to ruin a lot of the detail that I can do some more once it's baked so there you go. <laughs> and then I'm just gonna go relax, maybe play some games. Um, I bought I bought games on GOG. That's you know because winter sales and everything. I bought Double Kick Heroes in particular that I want to to play a bit. It's nice, but it's quite hard. <laughs> And because I would like, uh, normally it's like you have to play it with a Guitar Hero controller uh, or something like that, or like a stick. But I've only got the keyboard, so that gets, uh, it's harder than playing with the proper. Maybe I'll buy a cheap guitar on eBay <laughs> if I'm really into it. Mm hmm. And I hope you have a productive evening too. Don't let the software get in the way. <laughs> I'm trying to gather the Sculpey. I've <laughs> removed the bits of monster clay that are in it. Not really productive, but oh well. Oh, it's okay. Mm -hmm. I'm tired. I don't have a comeback. <laughs> I'm pressing the wrong keys because I change software all the time. Oh yeah, I know what you mean. Happens the same when you play a game for a while and then you switch, and you're like, "How do I do this again?" <laughs> Uh, I just hope I'm feeling a bit better tomorrow for work. I don't have to call in sick. 
I'm being very dramatic because, like, I'm clearly fine, but... <laughs> like, I hope it doesn't get worse than that. Okay, I'm gonna end the stream then. It's been fun. I now have a better idea how to sculpt a dog, a dog's head. Um, yeah, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Take care of yourselves.